morning, everyone. We're going to get started in just a second. We are streaming live. All right. Welcome, welcome. Uh, if this is the first time joining, uh, my name is Ellen Wynn. I am an independent agent in the field. I, I signed up as an independent agent a little over six years ago with DAC, and I'm passionate about what DAC is offering. As a company, in general, all of our phenomenal services add true value to the end consumer, whether it's the business owner needing additional funding to grow and expand their business, uh, saving people money with our payment processing. But one of the things that I'm most passionate about is our health care program, and that is saving people money with their health care and getting them into the right health care product. You know, I've got more customers than anyone with DAC, and through that, it's been a learning experience. And these calls on Tuesdays are meant for you to tap into some of my pro tips uh, and learn from my experience and help you be better. It's not intended to be a replacement training for the basic uh, healthcare training that's available in the Agent Resource Center, but I'm always available to answer questions at the end of the Zoom. So let me go through, I've got a few slides that I want to share with you today, and then I'll take questions uh, when I finish up. We try to keep these less than 30 minutes, usually 15 to 20 minutes. So let me get right into that, and I'll share some good information with you today. Get into slide share mode. All right, slides are on the screen, looking good. Awesome. DAC Healthcare, powered by Clearwater. Um, we, we really have a great relationship with them. And through the past several weeks, I've been working with a very large potential client. I've talked about it many times, but it's really been a great educational experience for me. And I want to point out today some of the the key features that make our relationship with Clearwater so very unique. You see, we're quoting this large group right now, and we're quoting against their existing broker. Uh, their existing broker has put the healthcare quote out to um, about a dozen different carriers trying to get a better rate than they currently have with United Healthcare. And then when I presented it to the Clearwater team, they were able to put it out to about a dozen carriers as well. And those were different carriers than uh, what their existing broker had quoted. And we were able to bring back a quote that is going to save the company uh, $1.1 million or more at the end of, of the year. Um, and, I, and as I dive in deeper, here's some of the reasons why this savings is available through Clearwater. If you look to the right of the screen here, uh, the Clearwater ecosystem is very unique in the healthcare space. And these are things I want you to, you guys to understand. The value that Clearwater and our relationship with them delivers to us as independent agents and the end value that we can deliver to the customer is just incredible. How do they do what they do? Well, um, if you listen to Jason Sherman and his story, uh, his backstory about Clearwater and why it was created in the first place, he was a business owner, and he realized that as a business owner, uh, his number two line expense was employee benefits, and he kept searching and searching for a better way to do benefits. And through his, um, his last company, which he sold, he decided that he was going to really dive into the healthcare space to find a better way to provide solutions to employers. So what typically you see with healthcare plans is there's a third-party administrator, third party, as it says, then you've got the insurance carrier, or in our, our case, a health share plan, and then you've got the, um, the administration team that's actually working with the client, okay? So you've got these different aspects of a typical health insurance or even a health share plan, but Clearwater has put everything into one ecosystem, which is unique in this space. So understand, they act as the broker. They act as the third-party administrator. They have the, the MEC, which is the medically essential coverage, which is required by ACA on plans that are ACA compliant. 
our health share is, doesn't have to abide by those regulations, but some of our health share plans actually have a mech built into them. Um, they also act as the search engine to go out and search and get the best pricing. They have the health plans on, on major medical. They have the health share plans. And then they also offer reinsurance all inside of their uh, ecosystem. They are managed and run by Clearwater. Most other companies are farming out and getting all of those pieces from different different solutions. Therefore, there's a middleman. So Clearwater provides value by cutting the middleman out of the equation and being able to deliver true cost savings to the end user and a better experience for the member throughout the year as they're using their member benefits when they go see a medical provider or um, get any type of treatment. So we're about providing better benefits. I say we, because I feel like I'm so deeply connected with them as much as I've been working one-on-one -on -one with the team. So uh, the Clearwater Benefits Administrator is really the key piece in this. Um, so let's talk about the Clear Share membership today and why we are better. So our Clear Share program is a, one of the few health shares that does not have any lifetime maximum benefits. So you need to know that as to why our plan is different than some of the others out there. Our plan is available in all 50 states, so it's national accessibility. Um, it offers one of the shortest look-back periods for pre-membership conditions and uses a clear concrete definition on those. So uh, it only considers conditions if there was an examination, medication, test performed or ordered or treatment received, criteria that would show up on a medical record. So that's clear definition of what a pre-existing condition is. And there's no specific religious affiliation required. A lot of the plans, the Christian ministries plans, um, you have to agree to their acknowledgement of belief in a higher power um, or specific lifestyle and ours is non-denominational on that. So that makes it very unique. Another thing that makes our healthcare plan super unique is care coordination. And just so you know, this care co coordination goes along with our health share or if you have someone that actually qualifies for a major medical plan, which is the true insurance, if they qualify for that or not. Uh, all of the Clearwater plans include this care coordination, and it really is a path to zero-cost health care. How does that work? Well, the member is going to pay their monthly membership fee, which if you look at it in insurance terms, it would be um, comparable to a monthly premium, but since ours is not a true insurance, we consider it a membership cost, right? So they pay that monthly membership, and that's the fixed cost that a member would pay on a monthly basis, and, you know, over 12, 12 months would be your annual basis, right? That's the fixed cost, but the member has the ability to really save on the other costs that apply to their health care coverage. Um, the health, the care coordination team, if a member, uh, first off, our plans cover pre-existing, um, not pre-existing, but um, preventative care, okay? D members will be able to go to the doctor and get all their preventative care needs met at zero cost on most of the plans, the basic and the, um, the advanced plan. If they're on the HSA, that's not included, but the basic and the advanced plan, it's going to cover pre um, preventative care for free, okay, on those annual visits that are required. And there's a list of 60 or 70 different preventative care treatments, um, visits that are covered. For example, I just went for my annual mammogram and first ever bone density test. Both of those are high price tests. They're covered at 100% on my ClearShare membership, okay, because it is preventative um, considered medically necessary and is covered at 100%. Okay, so those are covered anyway. But this care coordination piece of our coverage is really unique. So let's say that a member has, um, has been told that they need surgery or their doctor is ordering an MRI or a CT scan. Those, those imagings 
that can be several hundred or several thousands of dollars or a surgery that could be several thousand dollars, right? If the member knows in advance that they're going to need that test or that they're going to need surgery, all they have to do is reach out to the care coordination team, let them know that this has been ordered by their doctor, and it then care coordination is going to go to work to find a list of providers that offer that service or offer that type of surgery. Um, they're going to be top rated providers so that we get it done right the first time. And our team, our care coordination team is going to submit a list back to the member who is needing that surgery or who is needing uh, an, an expensive test performed. And they're going to give that option to the member to be able to use one of the providers listed on through care coordination. If they go through that provider listed on care coordination, that means that the member pays zero out of pocket for that surgery or for that expensive test. So that's where the care coordination is truly a path to zero dollars on healthcare outside of that monthly fixed cost with the membership monthly cost, which again is related to premium if you were talking in insurance terms, but it's a membership fee for health share. Okay, so that's one of the really unique stories I'm talking about our health share plan and the coverages where we have zero max on what the plan will cover. This is a, a true life scenario where one of their members named Terry, um, after battling COVID and facing multi-million dollar medical bill, Terry received exceptional support from Clearwater. He was on the $1,000 max out of pocket plan and that was all he had to pay out of pocket. All of his other medical expenses were paid by his clear share membership, okay? So um, he saved $999,000 because he was a member of this plan. Uh, several weeks in intensive care, uh, all of that was handled by the Clearwater team. So know that we've got a tremendous value here on our clear share memberships. Um, I wanted to cover the clear share limitations because clear share is not a great fit for everybody. In fact, I'm gonna go to the next slide. Um, and talk about who ClearShare is right for, and then I'll come back to the pre-existing conditions, okay? So ClearShare memberships are great for individuals under 65 uh, if they're relatively in good health, okay? Once they hit 65, then they're going to be forwarded over to Medicare, and that's going to be the next option. We do have major medical plans that someone 65 or older can subscribe to, uh, but it may not be as cost effective or as, as as Medicare would be for them. So they could review that. We do have a few people that are over 65 that have opted for a major medical plan, okay? Um, and ClearShare is great for people that are looking to lower their healthcare expenses without compromising on access to care, okay? Also, um, if members ha are, again, 65 or older Medicare, if they have serious chronic medical conditions requiring ongoing intensive care, they might need to explore other options. And if they're a heavy tobacco user, they may face higher health risk and cost. And when we talk about tobacco, you need to lump in vaping into that. Any, any type of product that is inhaled or tobacco, um, whether it be chewing tobacco or snuff or any type of dips, all of those are considered tobacco. If they have nicotine in it, it is a tobacco product. And most of the vaping products do have nicotine, okay? So consider that. But let's go through pre-existing conditions. Um, there are exceptions to pre-existing conditions. So if someone has a pre-existing condition such as high blood pressure, high cholesterol, diabetes, type one and type two, uh, hypothyroidism or hyperthyroidism. Those are exceptions to our pre-existing conditions, okay? Um, if, there are, if they have any of those issues and they're being treated with medication, but they've not been hospitalized in the past year because of that condition, they're still a great fit for our healthcare. The ones that, um, that we, we don't really cover on and aren't a good fit are over here on the right. The five-year look back for folks who have had cancer, had a heart attack, stroke, or COPD, because there's 
limitations in what the plan would pay over a five-year period, okay? So um, if they have had any of those conditions on the five-year look back, that first year that they're a member, there will be no sharing for any of those, uh, that condition that they had already had within the past five years. Uh, their second year on the membership, it would pay up to $25,000 uh, if they had a reoccurrence or needed treatment for that particular condition. Year three, it would pay up to $50,000. And year four, it would pay up to $125,000. Um, on the one-year look back, any medical exam, diagnosis, or treatment, uh, again, if they have had an issue in the past year, if in that first year, if they have an issue, there will be no sharing. In year two, if they have a reoccurrence of that, our plan would pay up to $25,000, year three up to $50,000, and year four up to $125,000. So pre-existing conditions, you want to make sure that your, um, your client and you can do the questionnaire with them on your website, or we're going to be changing the way that that's handled. We're going to be handling that internally. Um, but that question is something we really want the member to consider and make sure that they're being truthful in their answers, because we don't want them to have something that's going to show up on the uh, pre-existing conditions and not be covered. Okay, so those are the slides that I had for today, and I want to open up if anybody has any questions before we end our Zoom. I appreciate you taking time out to be here today. Um, I can also field questions on the RX plan, both health care or RX. I've got Mark with a hand up. Hey, Mark, how are you doing today? Hello. Thanks, Ellen. Uh, you were you, the plan you're talking about today, was this for individual plan or is this a group plan? Either or. Okay. So, uh, health share in general. So um, over on your DAC healthcare website, you have the, the link for individuals, which covers uh, someone who's single, single with children, uh, a couple or a family. You got those four different options of coverage on an individual side. But on the group side, if they are uh, just a couple of people or so, then health share might be a good fit. Smaller groups, where they don't have any outstanding pre-existing conditions, they still might be a good fit for health share. But typically when we get into larger groups of 10 or more people, they may be more well-suited for a major medical plan because we, we really want to see the claims history and see if they have pre-existing conditions that would exclude them from um, being fully covered with our health share plan. And, and if so, then that's going to put them into a major medical scenario. Okay. Thanks for that question. Anybody else with questions before we wrap up? Guys, if you have not gone through the quote process yourself, and if you're not seriously considering Clearwater and our health share program for yourself, um, I encourage you to do that. Okay. If you're using it, then take advantage of the benefits that you have and be saving money. We're going to, we're moving into open enrollment period. A lot of people are starting to think about healthcare. And another one of the things that I really love about being able to offer this program is the majority of people don't really understand healthcare at all. And it, it's been an eye opening experience for me. The more people I talk to about their health plan, uh, they don't know what deductibles are. They don't know what deductible they have. They don't know what their out-of-pocket liability is with the coverage that they have. And our plans are very straightforward and are going to prevent people from getting into a major catastrophic situation should they have something happen, uh, catastrophic situation financially, should they have something happen. So just know that you're putting people in a better situation with a health plan that's going to help save them money on out-of-pocket costs, and it's also going to cap their financial responsibility in the event of something major happening, okay? All right, guys, if I don't have any other questions, we'll wrap up. I appreciate you being here today. Hopefully, you can join us tomorrow on our funding training at 1130 DAC.